When you see a need, you want to try to um, fill the gaps. Helping students is all Savannah Chenault does. She's been at Danville Middle School for nearly a decade teaching seventh grade English and reading. And that means hundreds, if not thousands, of Morgan County students have been inside her classroom. But this year, a new problem arose. We have a couple in seventh or eighth grade and sixth grade who speak no English. So I thought it would help the teachers. Um, at the beginning of the year, they're really frustrated and and like, you know, shocked, like, what do we do? Um, we can't communicate with these students. The school has always had ELL, or English language learners, enrolled. But that number is rising. And Chenault says they, of course, deserve the same education an English-speaking student would get. Our job is as ed educators to be able to, you know, provide students with equal access and um, a design for education that everyone has the equal opportunities or same opportunities. So here's how these earbuds work. The teacher wears one, the student wears the other. And in real time, as the teacher is giving a lesson, what they're saying is translated in the student's ear. A noun is a person, place, or thing. Chanel says Danville Middle uses them primarily to translate English into Spanish, but there's more languages to choose from. 40, in fact, and 93 accents available too, ensuring no child is left behind. Documents and transcribes as well, so it's not only you know for auditory learners, but for um, visual. These devices didn't cost Danville Middle School a dime. Chenault was able to get a $2,600 grant from a local company to help get these translators into Morgan County Schools. Danville Middle itself has 14 pairs at the ready to help students learn. In Danville, Luke Hydash, Way 31 News.